Yo, what's going on, folks? It's JR. I wanted to let you know it's summertime, and that means it's concert season. You may go see the NBA Finals, or maybe not the NBA Finals. Sorry to the Dallas Mavericks. You might go see Meg Thee Stallion. And Meg Thee Stallion is hot all over the place. But I wanted to let you know about junk fees. Because whether you're going to a sporting event or you're going to go see Meg Thee Stallion, those junk fees are those stupid fees they put on when you're trying to buy the tickets at the end. One of my friends just tried to go see Meg Thee Stallion. And she bought tickets at State Farm Arena here in Atlanta, Georgia. And she thought she had a deal. And the next thing you know, she gets to check out. And it's like another $100 just to go ahead and buy the tickets. It's ridiculous. So whether you're going to a sporting event or you're going to go see Meg Thee Stallion. Sorry to Luka Doncic. She's done just about. He's cooked. The fact is... You need to pay attention to these junk fees. And I know the Biden administration has been doing a lot of work to get rid of these hidden junk fees to save the money in your wallet and help the economy. So go ahead, Google junk fees, learn how you can support getting rid of them, whether you want to go see Meg the Stallion or an NBA Finals game, maybe next year. We got you all locked. Yeah, go ahead and use Google and make sure you listen to me weeknights coast to coast, the JR Sport Brief Show or the Infinity Sports Network.